What is going on everybody? It's Jo here and I'm bringing you guys the divisional round of the Mutt Playoffs. This is the second season we got going. I think we're in the first string all rookie. Still got to get out of that all rookie string. But you see we guys did not we did not get the first round by had some troubles winning some games. But we're going to try to get something going here early and you guys can't tell by the name of the video. It's going to be a rage fest. We're going to have a good one here. We're going to see how far we can push the limits of a human to basically raging in a video game. What we're going to see here, checking with deep on 3rd and 11, no reads whatsoever, and that was a horrible read there. 4th down and 11, trying to pick up a 1st down, Cutler looking, I got tunnel vision, R1 might have been open, but we end up throwing a pick, and the Honey Badger is going to try to do his own little return, and he might be able to take 2 for 6, making a move, but he ends up putting the ball on the ground, and Mike Pouncey's there to get the fumble, and we get the ball back, and basically that first drive never happened. So, Alfred Moore is trying to get something going, pick up the 1st down, maybe he could have bounced it to the outside for more, but... Just did not, just couldn't get around our offensive line, but there we go. First down again, picking up a nice gain. Then we got a nice little momentum, going to the play action here, but we end up getting sacked. Decided to throw him, but did, couldn't make up my mind. But we hit Jordan Reed on the streak here. Almost picking up the first down, but not enough going back to the play action. Hitting Dennis Pitta out on the flat, but he's able to pick it up. First quarter's coming to a close. Heading back to that running game. Only able to pick up a few yards, but it's okay. We're going to stick with it, and then this happens. He quits after that, so I mean, I guess I guess he knew it was coming. I mean, I guess he had to know what was coming. Is he really gonna quit? Yeah, no, he he really quits. So I guess I guess he had a feeling that I was gonna beat him bad. But we got a nice little uh, badge pack for this. We get a nice little quick sell, 500 coins. Gonna use that one. And let's see what badge we get. Bronze badge. Nothing important, but whatever. I'm not gonna complain. And we're gonna head on into the conference championship now. So, but I mean. If we win this one, Super Bowl's up next. That, that won't be so bad, but hopefully we don't get another rage. That wasn't too long. That was only like a minute long in recording time. So let's see how this one turns out. He starts off with the ball first. He's got RG3 as his QB. He's going to roll out to the outside and stumble, but he's able to pick up some yards nonetheless. Hey, going to the handoff here, and we're almost able to stop that, but he's picking up the first down anyway. New set of downs for him. He's going to roll to the outside. RG3 is going to look downfield, but he misfires and throws out of bounds. Third down and 10, trying to get something done. He's got a man open across the middle who's able to pick up the first down. It's his tight end, and he's got a whole new set of downs once again. Going to the slant pattern, and we're almost able to break that up, and Tim isn't even to break that up. So he's going to roll out here, second down and two, pick up the first down, and then some until he runs out of bounds. Don't think he wanted to, but he's going to go to the counter here to the outside, but Eric Berry's going to there to lay the boomstick. And here he goes, going to the screen pass once again, hitting his running back, but we're there to stop him. Third down and seven. Steven's got to come up with something big. Big RG3 is rolling out, trying to get something done. I missed the hit there with Eric Berry. No idea what I was doing there. But he's going to go to the handoff here, and he's in the red zone now. So time for the defense to make a stop. Handing it off once again, but we're there to make the tackle once again. Third down and eight. Can he get something going? RG3 rolling to the outside. RG3 trying to get some more, but we're there for the stop. And he settles for his points, which you don't see very often in mud. People usually just take go for it when they, when they get that close but first play for us no bueno handing it off once again same play you guys know i love my pistol offense and we're under the two minute warning so we got some time to move the ball but we're going here deep in the play action to anquan bolden and this might be the last season you guys see anquan bolden big changes for the third season but here he goes laying the boomstick on us and second down and six we're on his side of the field as we hit anquan bolden with a dot across the middle picking it up and then some Alfred Morris up the middle getting big hit but hanging on to the ball. Second down and second down and five here. We hit Jordan Reed for a nice little game. Not picking up the first down, but we got third down and three here. Trying to get something done. We see our boy Jordan Reed once again. He was able to get on into the end zone. And my opponent's got about 18 seconds to try to try to get something done. Try to. Let's see if he actually will. He's just gonna roll around with RG3. That, that's not really gonna do him too much. He's gotta get into field goal range. Gotta move something better. And he goes for buck sweep here. Not really the best play call. Probably could have fumbled it there. And this last play is just going to try to get something going. RG3 going to chuck one up deep, trying to test Casey Hayward. And Casey Hayward saying, nah, -uh, not on my watch. And we're going to try to return this before halftime, but that's not happening. So, we got into half with a nice little 7-3 lead. Hand this one off to Alfie, who gets big hit, but is able to hang on. Second down and eight. Cutler stepping back. Cutler trying to make a read, but Cutler's going to take off on his own here and pick up a few yards. Felt the pressure from behind. And it's third down and two. We're able to pick it up with Alfie once again. Going to the buck sweep of our own here, picking up a few yards. You guys start to get the get the gist. I run it, play action. Run it, play action. It's it's a nice little 
Nice little setup I got here, but here we go. Chucking this one deep on third down and 14. Randall Cobb, the short man, goes up and snatches it. Going up top to Randall Cobb, and he does not disappoint. Hand this one off to Alfred Morris. Cutler going to roll out. We got our boy Jordan Reed wide open for the touchdown. And we take a nice little two-possession lead, 11 points. RG3 going to step back, go across the middle, and hit his target in a swarm of blue. And I'm changing the uh, Giants jerseys. Don't worry for next season. I will this time as we get the pressure to RG3. Bring up a third down and 14. He's looking for his man across the middle. And Casey Hayward and Co. are able to knock that one down. Bring it up fourth down and 14. He's going across the middle. And we were right there with Kiko Alonso, who is probably the MVP. Him or Alfred Morris or Cutler. Maybe even Bolden. I don't even know. But we have some studs that always seem to just to show up in, in games here. Here we go. Just going for the kill shots. The fourth quarter. Hand the ball here to Alfred Morris. Take us all the way to the two-minute warning. Third down and two, Cutler stepping back, looking across the middle. As we hit Victor Cruz, but he's not able to hang on. So we just take our points, give ourselves a nice little two-touchdown lead. Can't lose on anything wacky. And after the Super Bowl, I'm not really taking my chances. So he's going to roll out here with RG3. Going to try to chuck one up deep. And Casey Hayward is able to knock that one loose. He had it for a second, but Casey Hayward is able to recover. So once again, going to chuck this one across, and we're able to pop that one loose once again. RG3 going to step back. Going to go across the middle. Kiko Alonso's there, but he's not able to make the pick. Fourth down. Can he get something going here? Throwing across, and we're able to knock that one away. And game's paused again. Guys, what do you, what, what could you imagine this be? Just take a wild guess. He quit the game. So, in the next video, you guys will see the Super Bowl. Hopefully that's not a rage quit either, but we got a nice little bronze badge and the quick sell. And hope you guys are enjoying the second season of Mutt. Like I said, didn't show many gameplay in the regular season because there wasn't much going on. We got the Super Bowl up next. Leave a like, guys, if you guys are enjoying this. Comment and subscribe for more gameplay. I'll see you guys all in the next video in the Super Bowl. Peace.